What's up everyone? My name is Nigark. Welcome back to Life in Bunker. Um, yeah, I'm already seeing some issues here with my people starving. My people like starving. My water is doing not great. My power is are okay. But, uh, yeah. We already have starving issues. And that's because, uh, food is a really, really tough thing to do. So these are maturing, but no one is working on them. That's what's... That's what's kind of getting me here. So I think what I need to actually do is build more metal floors over here. Build more metal floors. And then get another one of those. I think that's that's how it works, is I actually need more of that. So we're going to fast forward, make sure that they build all of this up. And you know what, we can even um, start just assembling just a little bit more, just to make sure that there is space here. Yeah, my, my air purifiers are just super cranky with me right now because they have to, um... Oh, that's a big air purifier. I don't even have that researched yet. Because they have to purify all of this garbage air out here. So that's something that I'm thinking about. Also, trash is getting a little bit high. So that's something that I also have to worry about. And if I look over here, you can see some people are not really doing great on health or happiness. Oh, absolute life satisfaction. Cool. But, um, one thing that I really do need is... Where is it? It's one of these. Not incubator, not storage, doors and lifts, life support. No, it's... Electricity and water. No, it has to be in here. It is in... Where is it? Oh, infirmary. So we can heal people up if they get if they get all hurt. So 150 building materials to do this, it does kinda suck a little bit. But we do need one. So we are gonna get one. And that is also going to mean that we need a scientist to man it. So there we go. And we do need more farmers. And maybe more than just one janitor. You're gonna be a cook. Cena can't do anything, which is odd. Is Cena old? When people get old, basically they stay in the colony and don't do anything. It's great. It's awesome. Fast forward. Why why is no one working? Why no one work? Oh, it's probably because they're all asleep. Yeah, we don't really have enough beds either. So let's see if I can squeeze in another bed somewhere. Maybe they'll be fine next to each other. Maybe. Blech. Don't, don't do that. People are using the toilet. Oh, Neggy, Neggy Neggington. Oops, something has just broken down if you don't, if you didn't, if you didn't forget to assign an engineer, he will quickly deal with the issue. So what broke down? Oh, our vegetable storage, sweet. And then you can see like a uh, service priority here, which I can scale up all the way up to 10 and all the way down to zero. And that's on pretty much everything. So like our power is going to be 10. Our air purifying should probably be on like a one. And I'm assuming 10 is like more, more priority. Water is going to be on like a five. Yeah. Make sure that this is still going. It is. It seems like one of the water pipes has been broken. It may have disabled some objects. Our engineers should easily fix it. So we can see there's the broken pipe. An engineer should come and fix it. But I think I honestly only have one engineer. I do. I only have one engineer. So let's, let's take you off of farming. And then make make some engineers. So that everything can get fixed as they break, because we really, really do not want stuff being broken. We do have an infirmary, and we should have a scientist that will man that whenever she isn't busy. Which will be good. In fact, you know what? I am going to put a wall right here. Do that, and we're also going to get another bed. 
a single pad. There you go. It's not the best place to live, but it is a place. I should probably get a door here, too. Uh, doors? Walls? Okay, where's the doors? Doors and lifts. Single door, double door. So, definitely do not need a double door, just need a single... Oh, wow. Door is big. <laughs> okay. Um... Deconstruct those, so I can make the door. Yes, we are still having issues with making food. And honestly, how many cooks do I have? Just two? That's fine. I was just making sure that I didn't have too many. And then, what is it for a... a thing, a research thing? Uh, there's, there's the badness. Okay, we're still, we're still going up in garbage. I don't think there's a way to get rid of garbage. I think you can just keep storing garbage. So that's something that I do have to kind of worry about. Research station. 200 building materials to get one of these. Which I do, definitely do not have. I only have 114. Only have 114 of them thangs. That thing is still mining away. In fact, let's start working our way over, over there, just for when that one runs out, we can have that tunnel ready. Yeah, it looks like we're having issues... Yeah, keeping, keeping up with food, so we're gonna place metal all in here. When the automatic doors lose power or get broken, they must be manually operated. Oh no. So one of my things must have got broken or lost power. The very first death on your watch, it's a sad day for the whole bunker. Who died? Uh, someone... Our great... Uh, Kyriakos Shamanur has passed away. He had an outstanding sense of humor. The residents are starving, yes, I know. I'm actively working on that, and then you can see the corpse. And the janitor is cleaning it up. Which I think it counts as a garbage. They said... Yeah, you did clean it up, okay. And then we are going to get one more vegetable patch here. The reason I expanded is because I don't know if I do this, if um, the people will be able to work on both sides, so I'm just being safe by doing that. Because I think what's happening is this can only go up to like 100% condition, and then they just sort of leave it alone, and then it just cultivates at its own pace. I'm not 100% sure, but I think that having two is proper. See, we got eight vegetables, which is going to be food, which is going to be great. Oh, people are being born. There we go. Pan Lin was trying- wait. Was trying to hide his real age to avoid work, but no one can escape the watchful warden's eye. Someone else passed away has become of age and can now work with the other adults. Yeah. People are still starving. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Pretty good. I just realized- my F3 key is really weirdly locked. So 50 cycles. Is this already our fifth cycle? If so, then that's pretty insane, because I've- I feel like I barely just got started and it's like a tenth of the way through the game. If that's true. Make sure that you're still producing like a madman. Water is still having a little bit of issue. Which... How much does the plants take anyways? Ten. Okay, so we will be out of water if we do this. At least on this... This water system. So I think what I might have to do is... Build a water pump in here. Concrete floor. Okay, we'll, we'll do a concrete floor. That's fine. Deconstruct the flooring. And then I will separate it from this. Which will be fine. I also wanted the door over here. 
That doesn't work. Yeah, you can see it's warning me about everything. Water level is low, some objects have been shut down. Uh, residents are starving. Yeah, trust me, I'm, I'm trying to get on top of it. This is my first game that isn't the tutorial, so I don't expect things to go perfect at, like, at all. I expect things to actually go pretty tragically wrong for me in this one. But I'm gonna keep trying. I'm gonna keep trying. Yeah, people are dying. You can see we're down to 12 people. Kind of. Kind of 12 people. Uh, cook. You'll be a worker, because I'm running low on workers now. Everyone is, like, dying off. We need a janitor. Stop dying! Jeez, you guys, you guys are a mess. Okay, so we got that. Now we need the water pump over here. I don't have the materials to make it. I need 250 building materials. I'm starting to think that maybe starting with two refineries is the way to go, just so you can always build stuff. Because at the very start, what you don't have is a way to make building materials, a way to make food. You don't have anywhere for people to sleep, you do not have any toilets or showers, you do not have an infirmary. They do start you off with quite a bit though, I will admit. We'll admit, it's not like stranding you, it's just not great. So, hopefully I was right about this, but I need the water, because I'm not willing to let that drop any further. I'm going to disconnect both of these and make them on their own water line, is basically what I'm going to do. So fast forward until I get enough building materials to do this, I guess. Yeah, low on water, low on food. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty good. It's pretty cool. <laughs> and let me look, is there... Okay, I can't see it yet, I don't think. There's basically one area in the game that says, hey, you can build a lift here and go down to the next level. Which is just like a new level to the, to the colony. So that's, that's what the level up here is, since I never mentioned it a whole lot last time. We're almost there. Water pump. Water pump. People are dying. There we go. There you go. Yes, all my babies were born. Now we're gonna get more babies. Because we need the babies. Also, I don't know why the game doesn't have music right now. It should. Wow. You like that timing? I'm the music master. Okay, go to the water level, destroy this, and then reconstruct it, like, as fast as possible. Boop. Boop. Then we also need power cables. Boop. Just like that. So see, no water, no power. All sorts of bad things happening here. I like how they're deconstructing before constructing, which I guess technically works. We'll go on times two. Maybe I can handle times two a little bit better. So yes, everyone is starving to death. This is why I said um, in the last episode, if you really want your name in, I'll put it in, but... Don't expect me to pay any attention to it, like in RimWorld, where it's every person is really important. Everyone here is totally not, totally not important to me. Not at all. <laughs> so you can see our, our water is doing a little bit better here. Um, why are you guys not attached with water? Please explain this to me. You should definitely be attached up with water. Oh, I'm dumb. Because this doesn't have power. Nice. The water pump didn't have power. 
Isn't that cool? Isn't that awesome? I just thought it was gonna work. And it didn't. So I actually don't have a single builder right now. So you get to be a builder. <laughs> yeah. Things quickly went down downhill. We've got the first elderly resident. He or she retires and will live in the bunker until his or her death. Meaning they don't do a damn thing. They literally don't do anything. So I think this was a great start to life in Bunker. I think this was awesome. It's uh... It's gonna be one of those games. One of those games that I lose at a lot. Yeah. I thought the tutorial had me all set up. I thought we were good. I was mistaken. I was sorely, sorely mistaken. I think I have to wrap it up right there. I'm pretty sure this is a lost colony. I'm pretty sure this is a lost colony. Look at just how many people I have that are able to work. Two. Everyone else is elderly. So, yeah. I'm, I'm just gonna wrap it up right there, and we'll start anew next time. My name is Nigark, this is Life in Bunker, and thank you for watching.